Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice algebra equation? Finding the value of x here. From here, we can rewrite this as 3 raised to power x, then raised to power 3, then minus 3 raised to power x equals to 24. Then we have 3 raised to power x comma here. So let's a letter y be equals to 3 raised to power x. Then we write this again in terms of y, and this will become y raised to the power 3 minus y equals to 24. And let's bring this 24 to this side to form an equation. And this will be y cubed minus y minus 24 equals to 0. And here we can write minus y again as minus 9y plus 8y this will give us back minus y then we have y cube then minus 24 which is equals to 0 so from here we factor what is common in these two out so what is common here is y then we have y square left then minus 9 then plus here what is common here is 8 then we have y minus 3 left equals to 0. Then from here, we can also write 9 as 3 square. And we have y into bracket y square minus 3 square. Then plus 8 into bracket y minus 3 equals to 0. And from here, this is difference of two squares. And this can be factorized, and this will be y into bracket y plus 3, then multiplied by y minus 3, then plus 8 into bracket y minus 3 equals to 0. And from here, y minus 3 is common. We factor it out. We have y minus 3, then into bracket what is left here, y into bracket y plus 3. Then what is left here is plus 8, which is equals to 0. And from here, we can open this bracket here and write as y minus 3. Then into bracket y square plus 3y plus 8 equals to 0. So from here, we have two possible cases. We have y minus 3 equals to 0, or we have y squared plus 3y plus 8 equals to 0. And from what we are given, we represented y as 3 raised to the power x. We represented y as 3 raised to the power x. Then from here, we take this minus 3 here. We have y equals to 3 from there. Then it means that y that's 3 raised to the power x is now equals to 3 and which we can also write as 3 raised to the power 1 and from here we have same base here that means x here is equals to 1 so we can say x is equals to 1 from here then also on this side let's check if we are going to have a resolution we have a as 1 as this coefficient of y square b as 3 and c as 8 so using the discriminant b square minus 4 ac b square that's 3 square minus 4 a is 1 and c is 8 so this will give us 9 minus 32 and then uh, 9 minus 32 will be equal to minus 23, which is less than 0. So from here, no resolution here. We have no resolution on this side. Then from here, we have x equals to 1. Then we can confirm and uh, check if x equals to 1 satisfy the given problem. So we are given x3 x 3 raised to the power 3x minus 3 raised to the power x equals to 24. 
and we got x to be equals to 1. So when we substitute x equals to 1 from here, that will be 3 raised to power 3 times 1, and that's still 3, that's 3 raised to power 3. Then my, you know, 3 raised to power 1 is still 3, then is it equals to 24. Then from here, 3 raised to power 3, that's 3 times 3 times 3, which is 27, minus 3, is this equals to 24? And of course, 27 minus 3 is 24. Therefore, we have 24 on this side and equals to 24 on this side. This confirms that x equals to 1 is our solution to this problem. Thank you for watching. Please share this video, subscribe to my channel, give a thumbs up. Also, turn in the description bell on. See you next class and bye for now.